Hello guys. Welcome to another session on Northeast Slet. We are going to give you a lot of questions for revision. Thank you for joining us today. Ready to start? <coughs> Yes, I am ready. So we have another mini model test. Yesterday also we had a model test for Northeast Slet. I hope you took the PDF from the Telegram group. Did you take the PDF guys? Yes, all our PDF together will be hundreds and thousands of questions. Hannah, I am fine. I am absolutely okay with God's grace. All right, shall we begin? You are ready? First question to you. Among the following, who authored the play Media? Media is the story of Media, wife of Jason. She kills Jason's new wife, their children. She's a figure of blood revenge. Media is a figure of blood revenge. Tell me, who is the author? Welcome, everybody. That's right, guys. Media is written by Euripides. Ta -da -da. Media is by Euripides. Hello, welcome everyone. Only one question over. Now, second question. Big question it is. Which of the following ideas is not stated in the Republic? A, an utopian city-state should be ruled by a philosopher king. An utopian city-state is ruled by a philosopher king. Is it, is it correct? Yes. Justice is nothing other than the interest of the weaker sections. Sorry. Justice is nothing other than the interest of the weaker sections. The four cardinal virtues are wisdom, courage, justice and temperance. Yes, you can uh, access everything, Tabasum. Guys, why don't you join our British literature course? You can access everything from the beginning. Only 3,000 rupees and you get like 30,000 rupees worth of material. Bolo, justice is nothing other than the interest of the weak. That is what is wrong in Republic. That is not right. Arrange the following works in the correct chronological order. Euphuus, Arcadia. The Jew of Malta and the New Atlantis. Euphuus, Arcadia. Do you know which one comes first? Euphuus is 1578. This is the answer. Euphuus is 1578. Arcadia is 1592. Jew of Malta may be 1593. Definitely this is last, isn't it? The new Atlantis is last. It's definitely last. Four must be last. So... This is roughly how it is. 
New Atlantis must be last. It has to be C or D. Hena. Now, yo. Which among the following plays tells the story of Bianca who escapes from her rich home with poor Leancio? Bianca escapes from her rich home with the poor clerk Leancio. And then Bianca is seduced by the Medici prince. Bolo, which is the play? Which is the play, Bolo? Guys, will you please like the video and share the video link in your groups? Please ask your friends to join us. Yes, it is Women we Beware Women by Middleton. Women Beware middle, Women by Middleton. Bianca and Leancio. This is very important because it is alluded to in the wasteland. Our love, let us be true to one another. For the world which seems to lie before us like a land of dreams hath neither joy nor love nor light nor certitude. Bolo, which is this work? It is. Yes, Dover Beach by Matthew Arnold. It is Dover Beach by Matthew Arnold. Yes, famous lines from Dover Beach. Which of the following poems by Wordsworth is not in the form of a Petrarchan sonnet? Is composed upon Westminster Bridge a Petrarchan sonnet? Yes, it is a famous Petrarchan sonnet. My heart leaps up when I behold a rainbow in the sky. London 1802, the world is too much with us. Bolo, A, C and D are famous Petrarchan sonnets. A, C and D are famous Petrarchan sonnets. The real evils indeed of her situation where the power of having rather too much her own way and a disposition to think a little too well of herself. Which character is described here? In Jane Austen, which heroine is described here? She always had her own way. Dekho, she had too much of her own way. She thought a little too well of herself. Yeah, they go too much of her own way. She thought a little too well of herself. Which of these heroines it is? It is Emma Woodhouse. Emma Woodhouse. Will you remember, guys? Thank you for correct, saying the correct answers. Please like the video, guys. And also, please... Share in your groups so that other people can come and watch with us. Bulao na apne friends ko. Please. Aajao sab log. Bolo na. Then. Whom did Jane Eyre confide in about her unhappiness with her stay at Gateshead Hall? Tadadang. Jane Eyre confided in whom? That person sent her to Lowood School. It is the doctor, Mr. Lloyd. The doctor, Mr. Lloyd. Will you remember? Mr. Lloyd tells Mrs. Reed, send her to Lowood School. Okay? Then, on the death of a fair infant dying of a cough, is a poem by On the Death of a Fair Infant Dying of a Cough. Is an early poem by, do you remember? Yes, it is John Milton. John Milton wrote On the Death of a Fair Infant Dying of a Cough. Who wrote Tetracordon? 
my god have you heard of that tetrachord and i will tell you is one of four pamphlets written by this man tetrachord is one of four pamphlets written by this man it is which one tell me tetrachord is one of the four divorce tracks yes tetrachord is one of the four divorce tracks it is written by john milton of course john milton wrote tetrachord one of the four divorce pamphlets will you remember guys that is very important next question to you which of the of which of these plays talks about three characters mick aston and davis which of these plays talks about mick aston and davis bolo it's a chaotic world that is presented here with menace a chaotic world <laughs> milton the divorcer somebody is saying <laughs> of course it is harold pinters the caretaker that is right guys many of you said it right Harold Pinter's The Caretaker. We have to turn to poetry to interpret life for us, to console us, to sustain us. Without poetry, our signs will appear incomplete. Which poet shares these thoughts in his critical work? Which poet said this? It is Matthew Arnold. Matthew Arnold said we have to turn to poetry away from religion and philosophy to interpret life for us to console us to sustain us without poetry our signs will appear incomplete the subtitle of the historical novel is tis 60 years since which novel is thus subtitled which novel is subtitled tis 60 years since bolo which novel is subtitled tis 60 years since which is also a phrase repeated throughout the novel it is waverly why is it called tis 60 years since because it is referring to the second jacobite rebellion this 60 years since is referring to the second jacobite rebellion okay guys next question to you tada dang this novel of charlotte bronte is set against the backdrop of the luddite uprisings do you know guys what are luddite uprisings luddite uprisings means uprisings or rebellions in the textile industry which is the novel set against the luddite uprisings which novel of charlotte bronte is set against luddite uprisings it is shirley shirley is a condition of england novel shirley is a condition of england novel all right which novel by charles dickens ends with the marriage of augustus snodgrass and emily wardle Which novel by Charles Dickens ends with the marriage of Augustus Snodgrass and Emily Wardle? Do you know these characters? They are in a novel published in eighteen thirty-six. Eighteen thirty-six is the publication year of his first novel, *The Pickwick Papers*. 
Tadadang! Pickwick Papers has characters Augustus Snodgrass and Emily Wardle. Will you remember? In the novel Middlemarch, big novel by George Eliot. In the novel Middlemarch, Tertius Lydgate is a dash by profession. Wow, tell me, Tertius Lydgate is a dash by profession. In the novel Middle March, Tertius Lydgate is a dash by profession. Bolo, Tertius Lydgate is the foil character. The main character is Dorothy Abrook. Tertius Lydgate is a foil character. Tertius Lydgate is married to Rosamund Vincy. And he is a doctor by profession. Will you remember guys? He is a doctor by profession. ta da da Fork Tales from India. Wow! Have you heard of that one? Fork Tales from India is an enchanting collection of 110 tales. Translated from 22 different languages. 110 tales translated from 22 different languages. Which author wrote this work? He is a folklorist. That is the clue. He is a folklorist. It is A.K. Ramanujan. A.K. Ramanujan wrote folk, folk tales from India. Who wrote the novel Godan, which was translated as the gift of a cow? Tell me, Godan, Godan, gift of a cow, cause it is Premchand. Everybody might know that one. Who translated the Ramayana and Mahabharata for the first time in Locksley Hall Meter? Who translated Ramayana and Mahabharata in Locksley Hall Meter? Very famous early Indian writer, Ramesh Chandradat. Ramesh Chandradat is the cousin of Torudat and Arudat. Did you know that? Ramesh Chandradat. Then, which of the following is a collection of prose based on Rabindranath Tagore's lectures at Manchester College? Wow! A collection of prose works. Based on Rabindranath Tagore's lectures, which he delivered in 1930 at Manchester College. Bolo, it is the religion of man. The religion of man. Okay, collection of prose by Rabindranath Tagore. Right. Next question, which of the following works by Sarojini Naidu was published posthumously? Sarojini Naidu published posthumously. This is an early Indian work and she, she no, this is an early Indian writer and The Father of the Dawn was published posthumously. The Father of the Dawn. Which novel begins, I was born in the city of Bombay? In which uh, it is Midnight Children. Tell me, in which uh, hospital was he born? Salim Sinai was born in which hospital? In Dr. Narlika's hospital. Dr. Narlika's hospital. And who was the nurse? Mary Pereira. Who was the mother? Actually, it's supposed to be Amina Sinai, but he is the, the son of Vanita. The story of a hero with a nervous breakdown and the pathological study of a neurotic Maharaja appear in which novel by Mulkra Janant? The story of a hero with a nervous breakdown. Lal Bahadur Shastri is a character. Victor Ashok Kumar of Shampur is a character. Victor Ashok Kumar of Shampur 
Yes, the private life of an Indian prince. The private life of an Indian prince. Tell me who wrote the Bostonians? Who wrote the Bostonians? A satirical novel on New England reformers. It is Henry James. The Bostonians is by Henry James. When Huck and Jim float downstream in their raft, which place were they heading to? They are heading to Cairo. They are heading to the place called Cairo in America itself. Which playwright won the Pulitzer Prize four times? Which playwright won Pulitzer Prize four times? Playwright is Eugene O'Neill. Eugene O'Neill won Pulitzer Prize four times for drama. The Robert Frost won it for poetry four times. Which animal does Mildred in Harry Ape compare herself to? Mildred Rogers. Mildred Douglas, sorry. In Harry Ape compares herself to Leopard. Leopard, okay? Now, during which war does the novel For Whom the Bell Tolls take place? For Whom the Bell Tolls of Ernest Hemingway takes place during Spanish Civil War. Spanish Civil War. Of Mice and Men. Tragic story of George Milton and Lenny Small. They are displaced migrant ranch workers. Do you know who is the author? It is part of, it is part of Dust Bowl Trilogy by John Steinbeck. What is the subtitle of The Last of the Mohicans? Last of the Mohicans, a narrative of 1757. The poem Thanatopsis was written by which poet? The poem Thanatopsis was written by William Cullen Bryant. It is a major graveyard poem. When did Toni Morrison's beloved win the Pulitzer Prize? Toni Morrison's beloved win the Pulitzer Prize. 1988. Which work of Alice Walker deals with a Woman fighting for civil rights. It is Meridian. Alice Walker's Meridian. Will you look up? Meridian is about a woman fighting for civil rights. Alice Walker, womanism. Which is the first modern novel in Gukuyu that Ngugi Vationgo wrote on prison issued toilet paper? It is Devil on the Cross. Devil on the Cross. Who, with whom did Almasy fall in love in The English Patient? Almasy falls in love with whom in The English Patient? It is Catherine Clifton. She dies. Catherine Clifton. Which character in Such a Long Journey practices magic? Which character in Such a Long Journey practices magic? It is Miss Kutpitiya, who is his neighbor, Miss Kutpitiya. Which of the following novels by Margaret Atwood can be categorized as historiographic metafiction? Because it's actually based on history. It's actually based on history. A woman is killing her employer. It is Alias Grace. A woman is killing her employer. J.C. Ransom. Founded the quarterly literary magazine Dash in 1939. Everybody, this is criticism. J.C. Ransom founded which quarterly literary magazine in 1939? Very famously associated with J.C. Ransom. It is the Kenyan Review. Will you remember guys in criticism? This could be important. It is the Kenyan Review. Another question from criticism. Literary Criticism, A Short History is a book written by Cleon the Brooks along with Dash. Literary Criticism, A Short History written by Cleon the Brooks along with Dash. Along with, you won't believe it, W.K. Wimsat. Cleon the Brooks and W.K. Wimsat. J. Hillis Miller talks about Thackeray, Dickens, Trollope, George Eliot, Meredith, 
Hardy in which book? J. Hillis Miller talks about George Eliot, Thackeray. So many of these writers, major writers. The form of Victorian fiction. The form of Victorian fiction by J. Hillis Miller. Gayatri Spivak translated works, imaginary map and breast stories. These are originally by Gayatri Spivak's imaginary maps, breast stories by Mahashweta Devi. Next is also from uh, criticism. Name the historical historiographical project associated with Ranajit Guha. The first six volumes of this book was edited by Guha. What is the name of the book? Series, book series that he wrote. A series of volumes. Ranajit Guha is of course from subaltern studies. What is the name of the series of books that he wrote? That is also called subaltern studies. Listen to this. In which city did Mary Wollstonecraft and her sisters... Open a school for girls in 1784. Did you know that, guys? Mary Wollstonecraft and her sisters opened a school for girls. That is in London. Like our Savitri Bai Phule, Mary Wollstonecraft also opened a school for girls. Rebecca Walker is regarded as one of the prominent voices of Dash feminism. Rebecca Walker is the daughter of Alice Walker. Rebecca Walker wrote uh, an essay called Being the Third Wave. Being the Third Wave, famous essay by Rebecca Walker. Being the Third Wave is a famous essay by Rebecca Walker. Carl Jung proposed several methods to be used to alleviate or contain feelings of trauma, fear, anxiety. Carl Jung proposed several methods, very important, to alleviate trauma, fear, anxiety. Which are they? Is it art therapy, dance, movement therapy, all of the above? Art therapy, dance, movement therapy, all of the above. It is all of the above. All of the above. Uh, Carl Jung proposed art therapy, dance, movement therapy. The term libido was coined by the term libido was coined by the term libido was coined by Sigmund Freud. Did you know that? Sigmund Freud. From which author does Foucault derive the concept of genealogy? From which author does Foucault derive the concept of genealogy? From Nietzsche, Friedrich Nietzsche. From Friedrich Nietzsche. And Roland Barthes' Structural Analysis of Saracen by Balzac appears in which of his works? Roland Barthes' Structural Analysis of Saracen by Balzac appears in S bar Z. S bar Z analyzes Saracen. Saracen is a young man who loved a uh, who loved a eunuch or hijra called uh, Zambinella. Zambinella used to live like a woman. Now Zambinella lives like a man. And this story is told by the narrator to his uh, female friend. That is the story of Saracen. He divided Roland Barthes divided it into five codes. Okay. And analyze the story in a structuralist manner. That is the story of Saracen. I hope some of these questions will help you. I hope you will read about all these books and authors that we have talked about. Uh, I will not be doing YouTube live tomorrow. Okay, guys. Sorry, guys. Remember, I won't be doing YouTube live tomorrow. I will come back on Monday only. Okay? Tomorrow there is no YouTube live. I will come back on Monday. Okay? Don't wait for me tomorrow. Sorry about that. 
Thank you. One day I will take a break, okay? Sorry. Thank you. Bye-bye. See you on Monday.